This is Ted Bedrine with Pro Power Drive Systems. I'm coming here today to talk to you a little bit about our Pro Power Drive Swing Trainer T. I want to explain to you some of the key elements of the T that our pro guys do, some of the drills that they do that's going to help you as, as a younger player. Uh, and I know you may think they might be kind of elementary, but I, I guarantee you, if you do them, you will get better. What I want to talk to you a little bit today about the Pro Power Drive Swing Trainer T is what it will eliminate, okay? It's going to eliminate you from dropping your back head or your back shoulder. It's going to eliminate you from overstriding or lunging forward when you swing, okay? So that's what it's going to eliminate. Now I want to talk to you about what it's going to build, what it's going to develop in you as a hitter, whether it's baseball or fast pitch softball, okay? What you want to do is three simple steps. You're going to have leg against the bar, okay? Good solid foundation leg touching the bar, you're going to check yourself, make sure that the bat is overlaying the ball about the width of the ball, okay? You're going to come here, you're going to look at your pitcher, you're going to separate, that's one, you're going to turn your head on two, and then you're going to think about your hands starting your swing on three. And that's what you're going to do. Well, after you swing, you're going to notice your leg isn't touching the bar any longer, okay? You're in a good, powerful position. You're in a good, powerful L shape on the back side, and you feel good and strong. It's that simple of, of what you got to do to become that better hitter on the Pro Power Drive Swing Trainer T. You get here, and, and what it does is it, it, by setting up against the bar every time, like right here, set up for down the middle. So what it's doing is it's building your hand-eye coordination for when that pitch is coming down the middle, your body's naturally going to get you into this position here to make contact right off that front knee where you're supposed to. The other thing it's going to do for you is it's going to help you to develop your back hip power, which is uh, back hip point of contact. If you notice, you watch any of the great hitters today or from yesteryear or what have you, you watch them, when they get here and they make contact, that back hip is that point of contact, okay? I'm going to show you the same thing on the inside and outside pitches uh, also. Like right here, we got it set up for the outside pitch with the leg extension bar. So you're going to, same thing, you're going to set up your leg against the bar, you're going to check your distance, you're going to come here. Now you're going to be hitting the ball opposite field, right, is what you want to practice. So you're going to come here, you're going to go one, two, three. And if you notice, back hip point of contact. That's what it's going to do. It's going to develop that. Because if you get here and you get into this position here, you're done. Okay, without casting your hands, all you're doing is fouling the ball off over the dugout. Okay, now if you get here and you do this, well, you've got to cast your hands. Well, we all know when you cast your hands, it's a slower swing and it's a less powerful swing. The only way that casting your hands is going to help you out is if you're going to pull it and, and pull it on the inside. That's it. That is the only way. So, again, one, two, three. Right there. Back hip point of contact. Nice, powerful position. Practice that. It'll take, it's going to build that hand-eye coordination for hitting that outside swing. The outside swing is the most unnatural swing there is because your body naturally wants to get into this position because the power in that lower half, you naturally want it to, your lower half naturally wants to get turned around. So that's why it's so important to practice that outside pitch. Outside pitch, you become a hitter that can hit to all parts of the field, I tell you what, you're worth a lot more than a guy that's known as a pull hitter. That's the last thing any hitter wants to be known as, I promise you. Real quick, show you here, we got it set up on the inside pitch with the leg extension bar, okay? Come here, you turn your hips, overlap the ball, make sure you're right. Come back, one, two, three. Now I look at my back hip. I'm over here now, point of contact, hitting the ball here. I'm hitting to left, left center field with power versus trying to yank everything like this by getting long on the ball. When you keep your hands in short, and you come in here, and you're hitting off of here, you're catching the ball out in front like you're supposed to, that's solid power right there, hitting to left center. Outside pitch, right center, down the middle, you're going to be down the middle. 
The beauty about the Pro Power Drive Swing Trainer T is it's the only T that will develop your hand-eye coordination off your three power points. It is the only T that will eliminate three common problems that all hitters have. And it is the only T that guarantees you use it as we tell you to, you will get better. The other thing I want to tell you is as you're using the Pro Power Drive Swing Trainer T in the very beginning, take some nice slow cuts. Take easy swings at it to get used to the feel of a proper swing because if you have any of the bad habits, it will definitely let you know. Well, this is Teddy B with Pro Power Drive Swing Trainer T and Pro Power Drive Systems. I'm coming here today and I want to tell you, let Pro PDS get you off the pine and on the diamond where you deserve to be.